Yo, 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 YouTube, it's your boy, Jared, I'm one, the only one. Back with another video, sir, today. Yes, sir, today, man. Hope everybody having a good day today, you know what I'm saying? I told y'all I was going to come in the video about how to style these retro threes, right? How to style Air Jordan 3, white submit, and your demand joints, you know what I'm saying? So, if you're right there, make sure to like and subscribe, subscribe if you're new. Like I said, we're bringing different type of videos on how to style shoes now, you know what I'm saying? A lot of these shoes are not hard to style at all, I'm not going to say a lot of y'all, because like I said, this shoe is a neutral tone, so it goes with a lot of things. You can be very versatile with this shoe, and I got two outfits for y'all. So I'm going to start with two, you know what I'm saying? But each video I progress and get better with, I'm going to start adding three fits, four, then five, you know what I'm saying? Just get the hang of it, but also not too, too much for y'all. But like I said, I'm just trying to work my way on how to style. I mean, you know, I'm not addressed, don't get me wrong. But just on how to make the video creativity wise and you know saying stuff like that. So make sure you like and subscribe, subscribe to me like I said beforehand. But not further ado, man. Let's get to the video. So right here, if in this video right now, you can already tell I got one of the outfits on. Maybe, maybe not. It just depends on how you dress. So I pick, like I said, I pick two outfits. I pick a little streetwear, something, but I also got something like this, something casual. Just a little switch up a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Cause I can switch it up. Sometimes I can wear little street wear or switch it up. This, it's just a lot of stuff that you could be very versatile with. With clothes nowadays, you can be real creative with things, you know what I'm saying? As long as you put your pieces together, it works for you, that's all that matter. People are like, oh, they're getting dressed or whatever. Even though certain people will be like, okay, nah, bro, you can't do that. But as long as you get creativity behind on what you do and what you like, that's all that matter, bro. So this, I got one of the outfits on right now. Like I said, got a peat coat, you know what I'm saying? Got a graphic tee. So here go the outfit right here. So I start with the hat. So the hat right here, you know what I'm saying? I got my LA hat on, so olive green type of hat going on. So I got two embroidered like stitches in the back of my head. It got like the baseball, like there's something different on my hats, you know what I'm saying? I, I need to start wearing my fitted hats. I really do need to start wearing my fitted hats, but y'all can see right here on camera as well. Like, you know what I'm saying? I got the fitted LA hat right here. So on this side, I got the baseball and got a little bat in the middle of it, some fire, some different. And I got you know what I'm saying? Mass dude holding two guns. Something, you know what I'm saying? Not too crazy. And so I got this fire graphic tee, if y'all see on the camera, but here go close up. Fire graphic tee, bro. You know what I'm saying? Go a little, set the tone a little bit with the with the hat a little bit. So got Lil Wayne Weezy, baby. You know what I'm saying? One of the greatest rappers of all time. Found this, you know what I'm saying? This graphic t shirt and Abercrombie. If I don't know if you're familiar with Abercrombie, Abercrombie and Finch, I found it in there. Got it for, guess what? For about $8, bro. $8. I'm like, oh yeah. So, some slight, some slight, you know what I'm saying? It's cut, so comfortable, like a cloth material. Real comfortable, you know what I'm saying? Not itching or nothing like that. Not too baggy. So, a large. Don't fit me too baggy or nothing like that. Then also, man, we know we got the peak coat, you know what I'm saying? Something to switch, like I said, something to switch up with. So, I only wear this peak coat about two, three times. But, it goes well with hoodies or a shirt like this, you know what I'm saying? Just like I said, something to switch up in. Like, if it's like it's too cold, but it ain't too cold, you can just throw it on with a little shirt under there, you know what I'm saying? You'll be good and cozy. You got a little button up in there. Real comfortable. So this right here I got on right now, it's a size medium. I got this from Fashion Over. I got it for about $45. So, like I said, I only wear like two or three outfits, but like I said, super comfortable. It's a medium, and I'm like, what, 6'1", six, 6'2". Six, so medium fits me just right. So if you like 6'1", six, 6'2", six, around that range, or even 5'11", a medium fit you just right. Don't go no large because the large it'll be too big and it's already super long. You know what I'm saying? It just depends. I ain't I ain't too big bulk yet now. I'm a little slim, you know what I'm saying? So but here we go to the pants. So I got these pants from Fashion Nova as well. And I got the pants for about thirty dollars. I wear this with outfit one time, but I just know it will go real, real well with the shoes. Cause it got the cutoff with the zipper as well on the bottom around the ankles. It's a slim fit. It's like some like some joggers type, you know what I'm saying? Real stretch, fresh material. Not the type of material that you sit down. So it tastes like some jogger pants a little bit, but got a little more flavor to it with the long strings. Basically go with the shoes as well too. You ain't even thought of that, but something different, something unique, you know what I'm saying? And then plus got the retro threes on. Super fire, can't go wrong with it. You know what I'm saying? With the white cement. I think overall this fit, I like the fit a lot. It's just some, like I said, something different, something unique. It's just some bringing my creativity to you guys so y'all can see how I style certain shoes or well, I can imagine me wearing some that y'all be like, okay, I could I could work some with that, or even you know what I'm saying, copy the same fit I got on. But thing is, I'm gonna start learning how to put the link down below. Say so I can go to the exact items. It's just these items are old, and I got it from certain stores, so little stuff like that. But if you got any questions, or concerns, comment down below. Let me know. 
or shoot me a DM, I ain't got no problem helping you. Certain pieces that goes with what? You know what I'm saying? All that good stuff. I got y'all. On my second outfit here, second outfit. I like this outfit better than the one I have on now because I think this outfit will be more relatable for certain people or more people, I should say. So this outfit right here, I got a corporate hat from Cincinnati area, Indianapolis area, or not even those specific areas. You know what I'm saying? Corporate's getting bigger and bigger. So got this hat from corporate. And you know what I'm saying? Goes right the right tone with the shoe already. I ain't even go to the pants, the shirt, or anything like that. It go right with the shoes already. So boom, got the hat. You know what I'm saying? With the right with the white cement. So now next, the shirt. So the shirt right here is her. You know what I'm saying? That's my crush right there. I love her boy. She she beautiful boy. It's a beautiful, beautiful voice. Comment down below, man. Let me know y'all favorite artists as well. But this is my crush right here. I had I seen this shirt and Spencer's I had to go ahead and grab it because boy, she's so beautiful. But anyway though. This shirt is a large, fits me just right, you know what I'm saying? Because normally in graphic tees, I, I always get a large or extra large. And mediums, the reason why I don't get mediums because, first of all, they're too small. But after a while, I keep wearing your graphic tees, drying them up, they will shrink. So I normally get large or extra large. Fits me just right for a few few times actually wearing the shirt. So flannel here, man, you know what I'm saying? So too bad, it's not too big. It's a large. So normally in flannels, I always get larges. I don't get no mediums, extra larges. I always get largest and it fits me just right. And this one I got from H&M, got for about $20, red and black. If this fits right with the shirt, and also fits right with the hat, with the red and black tone, with the with the hair, a little bit hints of red, a little hints of little cream on the shirt. So overall the fit right now, it just, the pieces are coming together right here. Overall pieces coming together. Pants, got the camo pants. The camo just sets the whole outfit up in my opinion. It just makes that not outfit too not too loud not too crazy just that's a nice solid just an outfit right there with the camel hits with the camel pants not gonna lie you could also be very versatile with the top you know what i'm saying because the top is cool with the flannel with the cream with the little red but also on the bottoms you down there can do like some black bottoms you know what i'm saying some white bottoms you can be very versatile with this outfit like i'm saying so this i know this outfit be real real easy for y'all to relate to also got these camel pants from PacSign for about $45. You know, PacSign sometimes be waxing, but if you got coupons, you know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta use your coupons. I don't give us 10, 15% off. That stuff add up. I ain't gonna say a lot of y'all, especially how the way I'll be spending in PacSign and these graphic tees and venture stores. I'll go in and get clothes. I love, I love clothes. So I think it's what better. Definitely gonna bring out my side so y'all can see it. You know what I'm saying? I ain't gonna give y'all too much flavor, too much sauce. But I yell at some, some. But not for real. Like I said, I got these pants from PacSign, camo pants. Nice little tone for the, for the outfit. And last but not least, we got the Retro 3s, man. The white cement reimagine joints, you know what I'm saying? I think this overall, this fit, 10 out of 10 easy. I like this outfit better than the second one. I like the outfit better than the first one. Not saying I don't like the first outfit, but sometimes you got to switch up for certain people that dress in certain type of ways. 9 out of 10, you're going to see me in this outfit with the camo, with the red flannel, with the graphic tee and the hat. You know you're going to see me in that, but sometimes I would like throwing the pea coat. You know what I'm saying? With a graphic tee, swiping it. Let's, this is a lot of switching up going on, really, just being in my creativity way, so. But that's two outfits, you know what I'm saying? How to style Retro 3 Reimagine joints. Hopefully, hopefully you guys liked it. Comment down below, man. Let me know if you got any questions, concerns on how to style certain shoes or whatever. I give you my ideas. I was looking up on Google with you, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know something about dress I just love doing. Just putting pieces together, putting an outfit together. Just make you go like, oh, wow. I did that. I put that on. <laughs> But hopefully y'all like it, like I said. Also, make sure you like to subscribe, subscribe if you're new. My platforms down below, my Instagram, my TikTok, my Twitter, all that good stuff down below. And I will, like I said, we'll be having the Retro 5 UNC, how to style those well with two outfits. You know what I'm saying? So hope y'all stay tuned, man. Hope y'all like this video. More will be coming soon, like I said. Appreciate y'all. Much love. GR1 is out. Peace.